Hey guys, I got a question for you. Um, I seem to be having a block. I don't know. I made this painting a while ago and I don't know if I should uh, enhance it at all. I was going to make the antlers come out more or I was going to put some extra fine glitter in the black part of the deer. I got to fix the eye up a little bit, but I don't know. I, I'm just really having a block and I, I've done it before. And I put glitter on a deer and stuff, and um, it looked like brown velvet. It was really cool, but I don't know. This has been sitting around a while, and you know, I sold the other one, but this one's been sitting around a while. I just keep staring at it. <laughs> Help me, because I got a lot of other little projects, but if I can finish this one up, it'd be great, because I really want to get outside and start my spray painting and hydro dipping. And, I'll, of course, I'll still do the acrylic paintings and uh, the pores. Also, I was going to tell you that in next week's video, um, I don't know, either Monday or Tuesday, because I've gotten some requests. Um, people are asking about, since I posted the dry pieces, the top coats that I use, the resin and that. I'm not using resin on a lot of my stuff. Sometimes I do, but I've had some requests for um, my top coats since the dried pieces posted, especially on that uh, really nice clear glossy coat that's kind of rubbery and next week on Monday or Tuesday I'll be showing how I do that so you guys can do that too it's a it's a lot of fun and I just love the finish all right guys so until Thursday's painting I'll see you in the art room also for y'all's viewing pleasure I'm gonna end this video with some tips and hacks thank you for watching until next time